behave. Behave. The Biology of Humans at Our Best and Worst by Robert Sapolsky. I first came across Robert Sapolsky uh, through a lecture series. He is uh, sort of looks like a hippie, kind of, and he has a great way. I love the way that he delivers his lectures. He throws in a lot of little uh, jokes, very dry, very dry jokes, as if he's not joking. Um, and uh, I'm just trying to think of one off the top of my head. For example, he's talking about how the neurons emit, uh, or some, something emits um, uh, neurotransmitters, and he says, you know, they emit neurotransmitters, and you know, he names a few different kinds of things that they emit, but then at some point throws in oregano as well. I mean, see, now I can't remember any of the actual things that they emit, but let's say they, you know, they, they emit the, uh, all kinds of different neurotransmitters and, you know, they, this and this and this and oregano and this and this, and he just keeps going on and talking. Boy, that doesn't sound like a great story when I tell it, but it was funny when he did it. Okay. Then, uh, I saw that he'd written this, this book, Behave, which has very good, reviews and I picked it up but I haven't read it yet so I'm on I finished chapter one that's something it's a big book it's fine here this is just a paper binding with cloth a quarter bound in cloth but it looks nice here and that is embossed a bit Robert Sapolsky can look inside. Let's have a look inside. It is about, I mean, he's a, he's a brain guy. Uh, so it's sort of about how our brain, well, let's have a look on behavior one second before. So in other words, what's happening just before we act? what's happening in our brain, what, what uh, things are flooding our system uh, seconds to minutes before, hours to days before, because in fact, um, you know, it's a whole lifetime of experiences that build up the, the networks and strengthen different neural networks and things so that, so that you're more likely to do, to act in way A than way B because of years of experience. Adolescence or dude, where's my frontal cortex? I mean, this is what we're talking about. When, you know, his humor is, it's goofy, but I like it. I like it when it's goofy. I don't think other people, um, I don't know if I'd let them get away with saying something like that. It just seems really goofy. But I know, I like, I've, I've sit, sat through a lot of lectures from this guy and I like it. Um, and then, you know, all the evolution that leads, leads up to it. Uh, so there are, just a few more images here. And that is from Planet of the Apes. Um, there we go. Here's... Anyway, it's, I, as I say, I'm only on chapter one. I'm really looking forward to reading this book. This one, yeah, this one is about mercy killing. So I think this is about some violence. I'm just, geez, I just said mercy killing. I meant to say honor killings, which is the opposite of mercy killing. Honor killings, not mercy killings. We won't go back and edit it. Please don't take that out of context. All right. I love the way uh, he delivers his lectures so far in chapter one. I like the way that he writes. And I'm really, really, really looking forward to this book. So far, I haven't gotten far. But I am planning to... Uh, Go away for a week in January and not have anything to do but read. This might be my book. Behave by Robert Sapolsky.